Our aim is to provide a forum where healthy discussion will lead to considered evolution in the market. That is what is surely a sea change time for the industry. Well, I finally discovered all of you within the industry uh, know this, although you probably wouldn't use this uh, uh, language, was that the claimed industry from the recovery driver at one, one end through the claims management company, the insurance company, the PI lawyers, the medics, the credit hire companies and so on, the whole lot, were collectively gaming uh, the system and exploiting changes in regulations which have been brought in to meet a public interest but have, which have principally benefited this industry uh, to make a lot of people a lot of money and to drive up insurance premiums by an extraordinary margin. Now, Nick, if you come back to the headlines, they're not great reading for your members. When I'm reading um, sinister conspiracy to cheat the motorists, the dirty secret of insurance exposed by the straw study. Now the great thing is that we've got a blueprint to sort this out. That blueprint is broadly speaking what Jackson put forward and it's for Parliament now. So strong support for that would be great. I think the, the concept here is saying that if someone is a middleman, they add no value. Actually, if you're going to ban referral fees on claims for other services, what about brokers in selling insurance? Over time, yes, it, the premiums have got to go down. If they don't, then what Ian says, it will be true. I mean, there will be other methods adopted uh, to change the industry from the outside. The prize here is whoever can solve this problem first and get these costs out of the system and therefore, to your point, drive down their price will win an enormous amount of customers.